it's your boy John here. Welcome back to another episode of the Talk Walk. Hopefully y'all are having a wonderful day just like I am. It's gonna be a crazy episode of Talk Walk. I am extraordinarily nervous for today's episode for obvious reasons. If you guys don't know what's happening in today's episode, we are going to be freaking going to Victory Road. And I'm doing kind of a pseudo recording session today. Oh my god! I thought Sucklock wasn't supposed to be recorded in bulk. It's like two episodes isn't bulk in my opinion. But also the fact that I'm focusing on my final paper. That's a 12-page paper, so that's gonna be really fun. But anyway, here's the team. Everybody's trained up to level 67 through 69 because that is what I'm allowed to have going into the Elite Four. If anybody is level 70, I cannot use them until post um, Agatha. So. I have B in the front for strength, and then we got uh, Maximus and Adam being our two mons that realistically I just want to be using because I feel like those two I need to get some gain some synergies with. Um, I bought some super repels because I was like, yeah, let's make it as quick as possible. So y'all, I'm actually prepared. What is this actually? So. Yeah, oh, requires strength to move. I, that's right, I have to actually go in. And I actually taught B strength because, you know, B might as well get stabbed. B's HP is, is like, it's massive. Like, you got B, Toronto, and Daddy all having, like, 200 and, like, 20 plus, X, like, in that bar. And it's like, what is this? Like, how in the world do they have so much in that bar? And it's crazy. B's HP is, I think, the craziest, though. Like, almost 260. Um, just feels wrong. <laughs> um, but that is what it is, so. Of course, I do not mind that because that allows me to tank an explosion or something if I need to. Like, wheezing, uh, that's my automatic wheezing counter at this point. Um, so that's good to know that we have that. But it's still very, very nerve-wracking because it's like, oh, what is going to transpire? Um... And, you know, today I'm hoping, um, personally, I'm hoping that we get to go ahead and, uh, oh, that's right. You have to choose one item. You can't get both. Well, that sucks. We got the TM. Of course we did. It's probably useless. Although, my, get, my brain says maybe it's psychic, and I don't, but I don't think it is. I highly doubt that it is. Um, but yeah, we're just going, we're cruising at this point, and... It is what it is. It's just, it's how it's gonna be. And like I said, I am very, oh, I have to, that's annoying. Okay, that's a gen one mechanic that's kind of low key annoying, but it is what it is. Oh, repels effect wore off. So now I gotta go add and get another repel going. Um, Cause like I said, I just, the encounters, it's a cave. The last thing we wanna do is encounter 800 Pokemon. Makes sense, makes sense. Um, but yeah, no, honestly, I'm very nervous, as you can tell by the lack of actual f commentary, but it, like, being nervous usually is a good thing. To be, if you're, if you actually think about it, if you're nervous, it means that you care. Um, it also means that you're not going into it, like, being 100%, oh, I've got this, and being cocky. <gasps> Why? <laughs> Why? Why? Are you kidding me? I have no encounters, and now's where I find a Master Ball on the ground. Oh, my gosh. Oh, oh. oh my. <sighs> oh, that's pain that is pain that is literally the uh, like oh no 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 that is literally that's pain oh my gosh we we legitimately i yes we have strength we're good oh my gosh why game i think i did it too much yeah i did okay i thought so I was just, so I'm gonna go back. Oh my god. I can't believe the game just did that to us. It, it really did that. It really did. Like. Repels effect wore off. Okay, that's 
to be expected as I'm using. I'm trying to. I'm like using speed up now, so that d definitely doesn't help my case. But yeah, no, I. That sucks. We can't. And also, just so you know, we can't carry over our items. Uh, and so I gotta kind of explain the rules and everything that's going on. So that's perfect time to explain it when I get completely and royally destroyed uh, by RNG. But anyway, basically. For you guys, uh, on Friday, your episode will consist of killing Amon. Oh. I mean, I guess... I guess we're here. We'll just catch this out of Legendary, just so we can use our Master Ball. It's, it's a dupes on top of that. Great. <laughs> That's awesome. I love that it's a dupe. Um... Anyway, I'll just throw the Master Ball, catch the Mew, and then we'll name it Beanie because it's uh it's a it's a static, and Beanie is a good Pokemon, okay? But yeah, so basically, what are you what you're allowed to what I'm allowed to carry over is the Pokemon itself, okay? So the three Pokemon that don't die to your guys' hands, slash the half of the team that doesn't die to your hands, um, and I'm, they carry over their movesets, and they carry over their IVs. So it's the exact same Pokemon that is from the generation. So they're literally, they're going to be carbon copied over. I think I did it okay. Or did I still mess it up? It might be required to battle trainers. I mean, it would make sense. Remember when I said Victory Road is going to take like 12 minutes? Yeah, apparently I'm wrong here. There's a super pro. I'm like, where is it? Huh. Oh, wait. No, that's where I caught. Okay. Oh, wow, I walked right in front of... I straight up walked right in front of him. That was great on my part. Okay. And they're, like, like they're really low-leveled. They, like, we one-shot everything. But, to be fair, the reason why I did that is so that we could go fight, you know, people. And it, it really doesn't matter. The difference between level 56... And 46 anyway is so stark, it just wouldn't have changed a thing. Um, I mean, this Kingler might have been a little bit of more of a pain, to be honest, but. But yeah, so. Am I, I feel like I'm missing something really obvious right now. Did I, by chance, mess up? Very possible. Oh, wait, no, that's what it is. I figured it out. It shouldn't have taken me that long, but it did. Uh, strength. So that was just the way to get Moltres and stuff. Okay, well, but yeah, okay. 
So now I don't feel as bad because we got Moltres. We made our Master Ball worth it. Oh my gosh. Uh, we actually did. <laughs> I don't know. Like, it, makes, it, it just makes me feel better that we actually got to use the Master Ball. Like, <laughs> and catch a static Pokemon that we already had. And, uh, like, it just it, it makes me feel better. Okay, don't question it. We, we don't need to question why that makes me feel better. Um, and we keep finding random TMs that we can sell, so that's money, and that gives us more, uh, more full restores, because we're gonna need them. Actually, we could sell our, uh, all our Pokeballs and stuff now, too, because we can't carry them over anyway. So, what's the point in keeping them if you can't carry them over? Um, good point. Okay, we're out. Okay. We got this! We're gonna do this! We're gonna take on Lorelei, um, and probably Bruno, because we're only 11 minutes into this episode. Oh, oh my gosh! Anyway, so I can only carry over the three Pokemon, and I can't carry over any items, I can't, yeah, so there's a bunch of things I can't even do anyway, so it's like, hence why I'm trying to, um, sell everything, get rid of everything, um, honestly, I need to talk to Ryan about, or not Ryan, well, I mean, Ryan might be able to know, but I need to talk to somebody about how to maneuver the Pokemon, or, like, the Pokemon's abilities over, uh, when we get to that point. Because once we get to that point, it'll be a big, uh, big point of emphasis. Uh, gonna carry Super Potions with me, I might need them. These heals, I don't feel like I would need, but just in case. And uh, I want to check the TMs first. I think it's just a smart thing to do. Oh, Rock Slide? On Maximus? Yes, okay. That's a help. That's a big help. by Twin Needle. Rock Slide on Maximus is actually amazing. Okay. Maximus is going to be used a lot more. I'm glad I checked before selling. 27 is Ember. That can go. 14 is Sky Attack. That can also go. And 22 is Sludge. Hmm. Honestly, that can go as well. I'm not too worried about that. Perfect. Okay, now we know that all three of those can go. Um, and the rest, it'll be, all of this money gets used for full restores. Um, and each of these TMs literally just bought me a single full restore. So, win in my book. Buy full restores and max that thing out. It'll be like 20. It, it's 19. Okay. And that leaves us with $131 left. Okay. So we have 21 full resource to work with. That's That makes me feel a lot better. Um, and we're going to head into the victory road. We're going to take on Lorelei. Oh, jeez. Okay. This is nerve-wracking. So from this point forward, whatever dies is dead forever. Can't be carried over. The more mons that I lose, the more mons that can't go. Ah! Uh, uh, welcome to the Pokemon League. I'm Lorelei of the Elite Four, and no one can best me when it comes to the Ice type Pokemon. Freezing and powerful moves? They're my specialty. Your Pokemon will be at my mercy when they are frozen solid. <laughs> are you ready? No, not really. But luckily, you're pretty low level in comparison to everybody else, but you can have level 60s across the board! Uh. No way! No! Are you kidding? This is how we're starting this Elite Four off. Oh no. Oh no. This is not. Zapdos literally wrecks in Super Mario. It's one, two, three, three, half of my team. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> Teron, I'm gonna need you to- Oh, no! Oh, God, Teron, I need you to take this! Oh, my gosh. Thank gosh you're faster 
But if I see more Zapdoses, this is bad. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to do this stupid sweep strategy, and I don't want to do that strategy. That's a crit. No, no. Oh no! Thank gosh we have full restores. Oh, this is how we're starting. This is how we're starting. This is this is starting in typical John fashion. This I don't like this. I don't like that we're starting in typical John fashion. Can we not? If that would have been a thunderbolt, Tarot would have died, and that would have not been okay. Get out of here, Zapdos. Why are you faster than me now? It's a speed tie. Oh my god. Why does it start this way? Like, of course it does. And I mean, I get this is a Tarot sweep, and I should not be complaining. Because the whole reason you brought Tarot is you saw it had amnesia. But it's still annoying. I can't tell you that it's not annoying to have to deal with the Zapdos instantaneously. Um, and the best part is, is Tarot legit has five votes for each, like, Pokemon because he won. We had the first instance of somebody winning the, on the perfect time. Um, so Tarot actually got some mad votes. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited to see how this goes because everybody contributing to voting for half the team to die is interesting. So basically what you'll do is you'll vote for the three Pokemon you want dead. Um, and what, whichever the top three that have the most total votes are the three that die. That's how it's going to work just for everybody's sake and for everybody that knows um, is I'm just going to tally up every single Pokemon, the top three that have the most votes slash the top half of the team. Um, so if we get ultimately wrecked, it might be one Pokemon, but more than likely it's going to be probably at least two. I don't, I don't see myself losing three or, um, four Mons because the only way you guys only get to kill one Mon is if I'm down to two. So Gyarados, that's your ace. Honey, have we learned that you don't have Gyarados as your ace because I freaking go and dominate and wreck it, okay? Have you not learned this yet? Because you need to if you haven't, honey. Um, we defeated Jessica. Good. That's good. We actually, I feel like, we actually did do exactly what we want to do. We want to go take on uh, whatever his face is now. Um... Bruno, so we can I think we can take on Bruno and be totally fine. So and by totally fine I mean we're fine to take on Bruno as far as time constraints go. I Bruno of the Elite Four through rigorous training people and Pokemon can become stronger. I've weight trained with my Pokemon. John, will you grind or we will grind you down with our superior power. You don't know how much I'd like that. Uh, I had to make the joke. You know, you know I had to make the joke. It was it was there to be made. Uh, okay. Mach <laughs> oh my gosh! Why does that make the joke so much better? <laughs> yes, Daddy is a Macham, and I just made the joke. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I love when just random events happen to make the joke just even better. Um... We're gonna go into Cole because I feel like Cole is the best Mon to handle this that isn't Tarant, who literally just swept the entirety of the last Elite Four member. Um, but we'll see. Because I want to use everybody because that's the kind of person I am. I want to use everybody. And I don't want to just rely on the broken strategy that is, uh, wait, counter missed? John, you just realized it has counter. Why didn't you do anything to, like, prohibit that? And why didn't he heal? This is weird. Uh, okay. Alakazam is next. Okay. Adam, get out here. I trust Adam, right? Adam is a really good Pokemon for us for this exact reason. If it hits more than twice, which it didn't this time, but he... he was dumb and raised his attack. He got greedy. He got greedy. Let's go, Adam. Arbok is next. And that I'll send Tarot in because Tarot can psychic this thing and it probably dies to one psychic. Um, but yeah, like, we, I, I'm scared of his ace. Obvious reasons I'm scared of his ace. Um, because his ace is going to be level 65. 
Um, no, it won't. It'd be 67. Um, so yeah, so his ace is going to be really high leveled. Venusaur, oh no, if this is his ace. I kind of really hope it's not your ace. Please, please don't be level 67. 64, okay? You're not the ace. Although, you're thick enough to take two psychics, I think. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you died to one. Okay. I was not expecting that at all. And Tarot is the first to reach level 70. And Nino Queen is the ace. Okay. The, the Mon that haunts Joy. That makes sense. You know, the Mon that haunts Joy is the Mon that we're going to end today's episode with. I cannot believe that we're already where we're at. But we did nail both the first and second Elite Four members. Let's see how the Elite Four goes ahead and finishes in the next episode. I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. I love you all so much. If you want to see the end of this, please like, comment, subscribe. I actually feel like this is a good way to do it. Um, if you guys, don't forget that next episode, we're finishing the Elite Four. You guys can kill half the team. So it's going to be an important one to see who is left. Love y'all.